Mamma mia! We are ready. <laughs> My biggest challenge with the waltz is probably going to be the energy. I feel like it's a quick waltz. One, two, three. The judges will be looking for footwork, posture, and for me to lead Yuvita around the dance floor. Now, this step is tiny here, and you take it there. There's a lot to remember. There's a lot to take in. By the way, I didn't make it easy, just so you know. It is going to be tricky, but hopefully we'll get there. You can do it, come she on. She believes in me. And here they are now. Hamza and Yovita, everybody. <laughs> okay, this samba was not your usual carnival style samba. You went for something totally different. What made you want to put your own stamp on it? Um, basically, the music, the, the yeah. rhythm of, you know, the flavor of that song was completely different. Plus, the meaning of that song, it was absolutely like. Um, I think down to earth, not yeah. like very happy, uplifting. Mm. And also, we dedicated that number to to everyone which we've lost. Yeah. Aww. And you know, it, it it meant for us much more. I I was very emotional that day. Yeah. yeah. And I think we've made few people emotional as well. And it's nice night. to see a samba take that kind of more yeah. emotional approach, which is lovely. And it was such a beautiful day. You both looked amazing. Well done, Vicky I mean, Gillard. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. And the hair and makeup, the obviously. They were incredible. Uh, but you had extra dancers again yeah. for, the, for the dance. Mm. You had said before that you were a little bit distracted by them, but you looked like you were right at home, right at ease with these guys. Yeah, it's, it's really weird. I think because I was thinking more of the dance, Mm -hmm. and like connecting with Yuvita and like making sure because I know it doesn't sound or look correct but the samba doesn't make sense to me. It's the, <laughs> yeah. it's the counting and the, the rhythm and stuff so I was more focused on the dance but they because we had a little rehearsal with them at first as well it made it a lot easier. And it just brought um, that whole kind of uplifting absolutely. spirit that you wanted from the dance as well. Yeah. Um, there was, the, this for you guys, was another dance that was linked to the wildlife, but there was an, a strange creature at Ulstree that night as well. Oh. Um, oh are yeah. you familiar with this animal? <laughs> the great uh, spotted gorka. Oh, the great um, spotted gorka. It's the great spotted gorka, oh, yeah. Oh, right, Dorita's a bit terrified of it. Yeah. Um, you know, um, I just back off. So yeah. he, he is a, he's a creature we've never seen before. <laughs> no. Um, all right, let's talk about the scores, because you got a 36 which is still a really good score, yes. but you yeah. were second from the bottom, which yeah. is probably one of the lowest spots you've been ever in the competition. Yeah. Were you nervous that the red light could be calling? Absolutely, because everyone is just so good this year. Yeah. Yeah. And normally, you know, four nines across the board is just perfect. Like, people are wanting that sort of numbers. Um, but yeah, I certainly felt the pressure. Yeah. I kind of like gave you Vita a mini hug as the results were happening, saying, he said to right, me, let's oh, get right, warmed let's, up for yeah, the... Let's for go, the, let's, the, yeah. let's do the dance off. He One was there, time. he was there. I was, yeah, I was limbering up. Yeah. Uh, like, we was, still have a chance. We yeah. do, yeah. yeah. We it's do. not over till it's over. That's Hamza. right. Exactly. Uh, Yavita, right. speaking of the scores, nines all across the board is still good, but you've been getting tens on every single week for the last five weeks. Really? So were you slightly disappointed you didn't get a ten this week? Um, I didn't know actually about that. <laughs> I wasn't well, aware Well, there you go, either. fun fact. You <laughs> have been getting tens every week for the last five well, weeks. That's cool. Great. That's um, very good. You know what? I, I, I mean, the judges, the comments and everything was right and absolutely. And I think uh, in this particular dance, because mm. it had deeper meaning for us, both yeah. of us, we weren't very like, you know, focused on whatever we're gonna get as a as a score. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, because it just meant for us more. Yeah. And and we shared the stage with other guys. It was just beautiful. And I think, yeah, it was yeah. It, it's we just, you know what? It wasn't what the dance was about. You weren't yeah. looking for results. You yeah. wanted to tell a story and share exactly. an emotion, which Absolutely. you did. Well done. Yeah. And you're through. You're in the semi-final. Let's talk about the dances. We're going to start with the Charleston, and you're dancing to this tune. I love it. Ah! What a tune! I love this song. Hamza, are you having fun in training with this oh, one? Oh, Lord, am I having fun. We are having an absolute blast. It's just so much energy and it's like, I thought I wasn't gonna like the Charleston, um, 
but you can see how much energy it is. It's just so much yeah. fun. And we're loving it. And, and you we've can got be a surprise silly. on this as well. Oh, do you? Yeah, I knew it. I, did. I said it to the they team. I was like, these two and their lifts and tricks on a Charleston. <laughs> I think we're going to get another one. Yeah. Uh, but Hamza, the only catch with the Charleston, right? Mm. There's a lot of footwork in the Charleston. Mm -hmm. You've had difficulties in the past with your footwork. How are the swivels coming along in the Charleston? Let me pass you over to my teacher. Oh. You're going to be very surprised. Oh, we go. love a surprise. <laughs> okay. He was born to swivel. He was born to swivel. We love the sound of that. Well, I'll swivels that. to the side. Let's go on to your next dance. You are doing a waltz yeah. and you are dancing to this beautiful song. Oh. I mean, this screams gorgeous, graceful oh. waltz, doesn't it? Hamza, yes. you've said in the past that the mm. ballroom dancers just make more sense Absolutely. to you. Absolutely, Is yes. the waltz the same? Um, <laughs> no. Jovita doesn't agree. No, nope. <laughs> I he love says ballroom. No. I'm like, yes, I love ballroom. He and was then she goes, so excited about the waltz. He was like, bring oh, it. bring the waltz. Bring on the waltz. The moment we've started the waltz. One, two, Why? three. Where's four? <laughs> there is no four. Yeah. Why not? There isn't a four in waltz. I'm going, ah, here we go again. Yeah, it's only one, two, three timing. It's only one, two, three timings. Yeah. Um, and for me, because I like Foxtrot and I like, well, I think it's like a traveling uh -huh. dance, but it's not a traveling dance. I mean, um, it still so, is, but you need to but rise. It's, it's up and, and down. It's okay, an up well, and down they're still sometimes. figuring it out. They're still yeah. figuring it out. Yeah. Well, but <laughs> loving, loving it. It's but you good do to like the waltz. Hold. Yeah. Okay, yeah. okay. Uh, a particular favorite? Charleston Waltz, quickly. Charleston. Ah, Charleston. Charleston. <laughs> Just okay, well, either way, we can't wait to watch the two of them. Good luck to the two of you. Thank In you the so semi-finals of Strictly. Come saying you'll be to everybody. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> now, much like Tom and Jerry and Cheese and Crackers, my next guests are perfect together. But what do the Strictly hosts make of our semi-finals?